Hi, Daryl and Kelly and everyone with Shoreline Power Services. My name's Christian Rinna. I'm with RinGen SEO, local digital marketing agency. Just wanted to shoot this quick video for you, give you guys some free tips and tricks you can use to increase your online presence. Uh, contrary to popular belief, your website can actually bring you leads in and of itself without paying outside lead services. Uh, and the leads that come through your website are going to be exclusive to you. Also, just having your online presence higher is going to give you better credibility in the market. And so um, three things we're going to talk about today, content, citations, and backlinks. The first being content. Uh, Google loves content. Um, all search engines love content. The thing to keep in mind is that content isn't just the words on your website. It's also the photos and what's behind the photos and how the photos are saved and alt tags and meta descriptions and site titles, so on and so forth. And so uh, the thing to keep in mind is that any page that you're trying to rank organically you want to have 1500 words minimum so um, this is your commercial electrical services page um, i know that's a high-end item high ticket item maybe 400 words max the less words you have the less value you're bringing to the internet and the lower you're going to rank the lower the search engines are going to make your website become because the less value it provides uh, if we go into your industrial service page um, even less, you know, maybe 200, 300 words max. So you're going to want to pump those numbers up uh, 1,500 minimum. Also, how your photos are saved. So I went through a lot of your photos are just saved as image. So they're just they're not saved really as anything that's going to bring you any value. Um, just remember that all photos and how they're saved is actually read uh, by the search engines in the back end. So make sure that how you save your photos um, is done right and you want to save those photos as buyer intent keywords and so um, I'm not going to go through every page just make sure that all the pages that you want to rank you have 1500 words minimum and then again with your photos so uh, next is citation so what a citation is is anywhere on the web uh, that your business name address and phone number is listed in various directories uh, those directories include uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Better Business Bureau, Yellow Pages, Yelp, the Chamber of Commerce, all of those directories give you citations. Um, as you can see, I typed in a commercial electrician, Traverse City. Uh, we got Advantage, Alpine, and Earl. Um, you're not here. This is really where you want to be. Um, but even more important than that, as you can note here, so Alpine Electric is actually pulling up as the number one position, which they are in the number two uh, organically but if you look here so top line electric advantage advantage is up here so top line uh, TNTTC uh, Traverse City Electricians Mr. Electric all these companies are actually ranking organically um, in in the Traverse City Electrician commercial page uh, of the Google My Business but yet they're not in the Google My Business page and that's what your website can do for all the various areas uh, before I did Traverse City I type in Grand Rapids uh, and I do not believe you guys are here either so if we click here we go to Grand so I'm not sure if you're maybe a um, franchise or what's going on but uh, even if we go to uh, Grand Rapids Michigan we got Web Electric, Aponte and Allied uh, but then as you can see Flat River, F Flat River Electric uh, Vanderhyde, um, All Aspects Electric, we got Control Electric, we got Wireworks, G Grand Rapids. Um, all these companies are ranking organically even though they're not in the map pack. So that's really where your um, bread and butter is going to come from is uh, with your website as far as your content and your backlinks. Uh, but as far as the Google My Business page, this has to do with citations. Um, so next I have your Google My Business page pulled up. Uh, a couple things I want to point out. You don't have an address, which is fine. I would imagine maybe that's because um, you don't have a location where you want um, you know, cons customers knowing about it. That's not an issue. Um, I do, however, suggest adding your website to the appointment section. Um, so there's no actual um, website list other than right here, but down here it's nice to put your website just to help drive more traffic, uh, make your website more visible. You guys do have six reviews, um, so we recommend 25 reviews. So just keep working on those reviews. Um, 25 minimum is what we recommend, and then these photos. So um, you're going to want to have 10 photos, which it looks like you guys have seven photos. So you're going to want to go in um, and give yourself 10 photos. This looks like it's actually a video. 
Um, but you're going to want to go in and make sure to have 10 photos. Uh, and then again, just make sure you save those photos the right way uh, and the right size and all that. So just do your homework on photos and how they're saved uh, and how it relates to search engine optimization. Um, but other than that, you do have a good uh, Google My Business page. You have one at least. So just keep up those reviews. Uh, add some photos, make sure they're saved the right way. And then the last thing is backlinks. So what a backlink is, is anywhere that your URL is at on the internet. So anywhere that shorelinepowerservices.com can be found is going to give you a backlink. You guys actually have 74 backlinks from 19 referring domains. But if you notice, your domain rating is a 1.6. Um, that's a 1.6 out of 100, so very low. Um, a few reasons for that. One is that not all backlinks are created equal, and so you want to make sure that your backlinks come from sites that are relevant to the trade and also not spammy. So um, keep that in mind when getting your backlinks. I would highly suggest going through and removing some of these that are actually lowering your score and then getting yourself some new ones that are going to help raise your score and also your visibility. Uh, this is one big reason why um, your website's not found uh, unless it's typed in. So unless someone types in Shoreline Power Services, there's a good chance they're not going to find your website organically uh, unless they go to second, third, fourth, fifth page um, of these search engines. So. Uh, I hope this video finds you well. I hope that you take the time to uh, implement these tips and tricks into your website to increase your online presence uh, and in turn bring you some more money this upcoming season. If you guys have any questions or comments or feedback, do please feel free to get in touch with us. And uh, thank you very much for watching.